Y'all get ready. Yes, you get ready. This news in the streets. Join us and tune in for the tea. Breaking news with integrity. So sell your friends and your family. It's the lovely TV show. Bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the lovely TV show. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe. Hey, tea sippers. I hope you guys are doing good today. So there is so much drama brewing right now on social media. If you guys do not know, Krishan Rock and Summer Walker are currently trending all over social media. So this is what's going down. So yesterday, Summer Walker decided to do this viral video of Krishan. A lot of people have mocked it. And Summer Walker decided to jump on the bandwagon and do the same thing. So I'm going to show you guys the viral video. It's a video of Krishan crying a few months ago because Blueface got mad at her for eating at Little Baby's restaurant. And so Summer Walker decided to mock that. I want y'all to go ahead and watch the original video and also the video of Summer Walker and her homegirl, Klein and Krishan. Check this out. Check it out. We talking about little baby in his restaurant. Fuck little baby in his restaurant. Nigga, I'm talking about a kid. You talking about me eating at somebody's fucking restaurant. Check it out. We talking about little baby in his restaurant. Fuck little baby in his restaurant. Nigga, I'm talking about a kid. You talking about me eating at somebody's fucking restaurant. All right, so you guys just saw that video. So a lot of people started getting on Summer Walker and going off on her for throwing shots at Krishan. So Summer Walker took to social media and she says, please do not take my humor too serious. My favorite comedians are Dave Chappelle, Bernie Mac, Richard Pryor, and Cat Williams. They say shit and don't give a F. I know this generation doesn't understand how to actually just laugh and move on, but yeah. So that is what Summer Walker said and then Soon enough, Krishan got wind of this and she went in on social media. She basically came for Summer Walker. She felt like, you know what, you be in my DMs, you be in my face. How dare you try and, you know, even jump on this viral meme and clown me. So she proceeded to show DMs of Summer Walker hitting her up and showing that, you know, Summer Walker, quote unquote, is fake. So in September of 2023, Summer DM Krishan and she says, hey, beautiful, check your DMs at Krishan Rock. So then after she posted um, the message of Summer Walker telling her to check her DMs, Krishan then went in on social media. So I want you guys to go ahead and watch these videos of Krishan Rock. It was right, I'm on my grown woman shit. I'm not, look y'all, I'm here to really just spread love and like say if something do hurt my feelings, put, put more love on top of that shit on God, but I'm not. Oh God, bro, like, I don't know what's up with this Krishan hate train, but it gotta go. So I'm kicking that shit out today. Um, I was like, if you was real enough, you wouldn't have posted that TikTok. That shit came off offensive. She was like, oh, damn. Like, my bad. Like, you want me to take it down? I said, for sure. You have a big influence, bro. That Walmart shit triggered me. Why am I forgetting that I'm human, bro? Like, that lady that recorded me when I was at Walmart? You ain't help me, my nigga. Like, when I, when I responded like that, instead of like, you know how I usually do spaz, y'all got the scene of real human inside me, y'all. Like, bitch, I'm human, my nigga. Just like the motherfucker that's on, a, on this other side of the screen watching me. Real shit. So, um, but like, nah, I fuck with Summer. I really do. I just did an impression only because, come on, y'all. That shit run me wrong a little bit. You feel me? Like, just a, just a little bit. Oh God, bro. I saw that video, right? I'm like, oh yeah, she thinks shit funny. But these, all the thoughts that was going through my head, I'm like, oh, she thinks shit funny? That's crazy. She don't even know that Walmart video triggered me. Like, see, more, more, like, I was like, all right, cool. Right? Loki hurt my feelings for real. Cause it was like, you got to influence how about you do a positive thing instead of mocking somebody that really got clout? Like, my nigga, I got a whole wave, nigga. I'm really that bitch, nigga. Woke up, I'm that bitch, bro. So it's like, me, it's like, I will watch how I say certain things about certain people. You don't know who they connected to, to who they influence. 
you don't know what you, who you could have helped out if you would have did the right thing for real. Because it's like, if I did a fucked up impression, my nigga, it would come off disrespectful, right? So I didn't comment. I didn't say nothing back. I DM Shorty. I texted her. I was like, <laughs> you're the same bitch reaching out, talking about, hey, do you need any help? Uh, I see how this new mommy shit, don't worry about it. And then you, the same bitch <laughs> that joined the hate train, the, the mockery, the joke of rock. All right. But, 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 but I ain't making no mockery of you having three fucking kids, no man in a fucked up BBL. Like, my nigga, a lot of motherfuckers, y'all can't, y'all got no room to talk about or mock people, joke on people for the fun of it. Check your life before you start fucking playing with other people. Real shit. And then y'all acting like I won't beat the shit out of anybody that crossed my path. Like, stop playing with me, my nigga. What the fuck? All right, so you guys just saw the video of Krishan basically going in on Summer Walker. So Summer Walker decided to clap back at Krishan, and this is what she had to say. She says, I really be forgetting I'm famous as fuck. Two million people make a TikTok or say the same joke everyone else said, but I do it, people are butthurt. Then she says, sensitive about a TikTok that was viral way before I did it, but you ain't have no sympathy when you be dragging bitches across the ground, dumbing holes in sinks just for looking at you funny. Let's please tighten up. It was never that serious. So after Summer Walker said this, Krishan then decided to go live with Stunner Girl, and her and Stunner Girl were talking about the situation last night. So I want y'all to go ahead and listen to what her and Stunner Girl had to say about Summer Walker. Baby, that is who he is and who he is. So I don't talk about my nobody because my shit ain't perfect over here. You hear me? Bitch, like the bitch over there acting yeah, like her shit. Don't want like, to her come shit back. Don't you got three kids, no nigga, yeah. and a fucked up BBL. So I be like, <laughs> <"That's so funny." laughs> don't you say yes, when you just got I hate me, it for myself to end this crazy because that's how I know I elevated so well because Stunner, I swear to God, yo. I used to love cutting bitches up, beating bitches up. Now I'm like, I don't want to do it. Why are you? All right, so you guys just heard what she had to say with Stunner Girl. Krishan Rock also posted this. She said, I could have commented, three kids, no man, and a lopsided BBL. Do an impression of that. So Krishan is definitely in her feelings. She's definitely feeling away. And to me, neither one of these girls are the right messenger. Like, let's keep it real. I get why Krishan is upset because my thing is, don't be trying to be in my face and send me words of encouragement and be in my DMs, but then you're turning around and trying to low-key clown me for clicks and views. So I can get why she's kind of triggered because I don't like when people do that whole fake concern, you know, privately, but then in public, you know what I'm saying, you want to clown and talk shit because that's not how these DMs are looking. So I definitely get that. But I also feel like at the end of the day, Krishan, you know, she's said a lot of stuff. She's done a lot of stuff. And so she doesn't really have room to clown Summer either. Yes, Summer has three kids by two different baby daddies. But before Krishan had this one baby, she's literally had four abortions. So she could have been a three or four time baby mama herself. You know what I'm saying? And she wouldn't have had all them abortions. Recently, there was a video of her that went viral the other day where she insinuated that she was pregnant again. I don't think the baby's by blue, and I think she was saying it for attention, but you literally just had a baby not even a month or two ago. Why are you even thinking about having another one when you're struggling and trying to figure out how to parent this one? Y'all go ahead and check out this video. Plans to have more kids? Do you want more kids in the future? Uh... I always knew I wanted to be a mom. I always knew I wanted to have 12 kids. So one day, one on the way, and how was the last 10 to go? So. All right, so y'all just saw that video. Now, as far as her saying, you know, Summer Walker don't have a man and all that stuff. Granted, yes, she doesn't have a man right now. But let's keep it real. Blueface is no prize either. You know, and since then, you know, she was with Little Mabu and she's with some other guy now. So, you know, her and Summer are kind of low-key in the same boat. But I will say this about Summer. I don't think that Summer is really a girl's girl. I do feel like Summer throws a lot of digs at the girls out here. Let's not forget, not even a few months ago, she was getting drugged because she was kind of, you know, throwing shade at Jada Wada in an interview. And Jada is little baby's baby mama. And, you know, Jada's like, well, how I get in it? Like, why throw shots at me? I've never done nothing to you. 
So for somebody who has social anxiety, it seems like she doesn't have a lot of social anxiety when it comes to clowning people on social media and throwing digs and daggers and everything else. So I find that, you know, very interesting. But I feel like at the end of the day, neither girl are in a position to judge each other. You know, Summer has made her mistakes and she's trying to figure out her life. You know, she's still young. Krishan has definitely made a lot of mistakes and she's still trying to figure out her life. And she's even younger than Summer. You know, so I'm going to give them both grace to grow the fuck up, raise their children. And I get it, you know, it's a joke, it's social media, but everybody don't like being joked about. And that's just what it is. Just like Summer doesn't like being joked about. She can try and say like, oh, she doesn't mind when people clown her. But no, I'm sure she does mind, but she'll just try and play it off like she doesn't because she's currently getting drugged about this Krishan Rock situation. So with that being said, I look forward to hearing from you guys. I want to know your thoughts on all of this drama that went down yesterday and today with Krishan Rock and Summer Walker. Whose team are you on? Do you think Summer Walker is all the way wrong and she's bullying Krishan? Or do you feel like Krishan Rock needs to get tougher skin? Because if she can be out here fighting people and throwing people in sinks and dragging bitches and green lighting fights, then she should be able to take a joke on the internet, okay? If you can take a dick, you can take a joke. I'm just saying. So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. Make sure you guys like the video. Feel free to share the video. And most importantly, make sure you are still subscribed to the channel. And I will talk to y'all later. Deuces. If you want the latest news in the streets, join us sentiment for the tea. Breaking news with integrity. So sell your friends and your family. It's the lovely TV show. Bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the lovely TV show. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe.